Hello and welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'm going to use a combination of ChatGPT and Canva to come up with a name and logo for a new business that sells honey. So let's start in ChatGPT and ask ChatGPT to come up with a name. So we type out our question, click enter, and see what it comes up with. So when we review this list and if we don't find anything that we like, let's just click the regenerate response button. So I think I like Honey Haven, so let's copy this one and save it. So now that we've decided on a name, let's ask ChatGPT to come up with a logo idea. So it looks like ChatGPT came up with a few suggestions. The design should be simple and clean, um, focusing on the colors gold and brown. We should also use a honeycomb into our logo. And they also suggest to combine some other natural elements such as bees and flowers to emphasize the organic and sustainable aspects of the product. Another possibility is incorporate the company name using two distinct fonts and potentially adding a tagline. So let's jump into Canva and get started. So from Canva, I'm going to go up here and say create design, type in logo. So we're immediately presented with a few different styles and templates that we can use. So let's go ahead and review and see if there's anything here that we like. So I like this logo here, so I'm going to use this as a template by just clicking on it. I can select elements and remove them if I want to, but for now I'm just going to keep it so I can see what my design looks like. I'm going to start by adjusting our background to those one of those colors that ChatGPT suggested. So let's look at this peach color. We can also try this orange, as well as creating a new color. But I think I like this peach, so we're going to start with this. Go back to elements, and I'm going to search for honeycomb. Enter, and then click see all. We get a few different options here. So I found this honeycomb pattern here. I think I'm going to add this to my background. I'm just going to add it here and then I'm going to hit the layer button and say send it back. That looks nice. And then for here, I'm going to find a logo that I can add here. And then for this section, I think I'm going to replace it, just delete it and drag this honeycomb feature here. Make sure that it's nice and centered. I'm going to rename this here. I'm going to call it Honey Haven. And then resize it appropriately. And so it looks like I have a room for a tagline, but I don't have a tagline in mind. So let's ask ChatGPT. So it looks like it gave us a few good options. I think I'm going to go with Maybe your source of sweet and sustainable honey, or maybe pure honey and pure happiness. I think like this one, I'm gonna go back here, paste it, um, and then I'm gonna adjust my colors. Maybe pull out some of this green here from the image. It would look nice. I think it does, um, but I'm looking at this background. I think it is a little too busy, so I'm just gonna remove it. And then this is kind of getting lost, so maybe just bold it um, and then increase the size. I'm a big fan of that. So just kind of playing around with this until I get it to look to what I like. Maybe change the font a little bit. So far I'm really liking this, but I'm going to try a few different things. I have some more background options that I could try. I'm not a big fan of that, so I'm just going to undo it. Maybe some of this. Um, let's into the back. Looks a little too busy, so I'm going to remove that as well. Maybe just some honeycomb right there would look nice. Kind of just adjust this around where I want to. And I think I have that where I want to, so I'm going to look back over this just one time. Um, I don't like how these are on two different lines, so I'm just going to click enter so I can separate that, highlight it, maybe make it a little bit bigger.
bigger so it stands out. Oh, too big. Click there. Looks good to me. So the more I do look at this logo, I'm not too big of a fan of this honeycomb anymore. So I can just double click on that, remove it. And I do think I like this a lot better. It's a very clean look. So if we go back to ChatGBT and look what it suggested, they suggested natural and pureness of honey, bringing out the clean design. And I think we really achieved that. We were able to include the gold and brown color. We used the peach background, which I really enjoy. We incorporated a, a popular symbol with a honey logo with a honeycomb right here with some flowers as well. Um, we used two different fonts for our name and our tagline here, as they suggested. So overall, I'm pretty happy with this. I can go up here and download this by clicking the share, clicking download, selecting my file type as PNG or JPEG. If I wanted a transparent background, I could do that by checking this box and then just clicking download. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and consider subscribing. Thank you.